Okay, well, hey, Charlie, this is Nadia from Texas in the U.S., and um, I decided I was going to make a response to your nerdy video because I feel like I am nerdier than you. Anyway, so um, most of my nerdiness really has to do with Harry Potter. I am a very big Harry Potter dork, um, and I've made a list, I've compiled a list, and I'm just going to read some of it off. All right, so... Um, I've read Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, or you probably know it as the Philosopher's Stone, um, 30 times. Yeah, I've been reading Harry Potter for over a decade, and it's pretty much shaped my life, um, my closest friends, and basically who I am to this day has been because of this book series. So if that's not nerdy, I don't know what is. Also, um, I learned how to knit in eighth grade. Uh, see I'm knitting right now um, just to make my own Harry Potter scarf so I could be Hermione for the premiere which brings me to another point um, I go to midnight premieres for all of the books all of the movies everything for Harry Potter and I've gone for Pirates of the Caribbean and um, just a bunch of stuff and I go in full costume and uh, for Harry Potter stuff I'm Hermione for the night and um, that's also my typical go-to Halloween costume. Um, let's see, I've been reading fan fiction for Harry Potter for five years now. Um, I mostly read Ron Hermione. Uh, I'm very canon, which I guess makes me nerdy too. Um, but recently I've gotten into other canons like uh, Harry Jenny and Rose Scorpius is kind of my new one. Um, let's see. Uh, I watch a lot of YouTube. I especially love the Vlog Brothers videos, and um, that's not nerdy. I don't really know what is. Um, they just, their videos kind of feed into nerddom, and their island, their gathering is called Nerd Fighters. How much nerdier than that can you get? Um, I also watch Dan Brown, and uh, I've been recently watching a lot of Dan 3.0, of course, and I absolutely love that and of course I watch your videos and Alex Days and I listen to y'all's music and that brings me to that I listen to a lot of internet slash indie sort of music like um, All Caps and Alex Carpenter and Skyway Flyer and um, Darren Chris. Darren Chris is my favorite right now. Um, he played Harry in a very Potter musical which has been on YouTube for a little over a year now, I think. It was put up in April of uh, 09. And um, it was done by this group that's called Star Kid Potter. And I basically know pretty much everything about the musical. Um, I'm a huge fan of it. I have been since uh, July of 09. And um, I love their musicals. They have a very Potter musical and a very Potter sequel and this other musical which is for older star kids it's called me and my dick and um their musicals are just amazing i have their soundtracks i listen to them all the time that's pretty nerdy i tell everyone who i come in contact with about star kid and about darren chris's music and about the musicals and um they're life-changing they really are and um let's see oh i always have a book with me i'm a big reader thank you harry potter and jk rowling again um, I literally always have a book with me. I feel absolutely naked and I just can't go out into the world if I don't have something with me to read just in case. Um, I actually choose uh, the size of my purse based upon if a Harry Potter book will fit in it. If a Harry Potter book will not fit in my purse then I will not buy it because I need to always be prepared to carry around a Harry Potter book. Um, let's see. Uh, it's easier actually to list my favorite authors than my favorite books because I just love everything by authors. Um, I love J.K. Rowling and John Green, of course, and Cassandra Clare and Scott Westerfield and just Meg Cabot, and the list goes on and on and on. Um, I'm mostly into young adult literature right now, uh, but that's always subject to change. Um, let's see, my favorite TV shows include West Wing, which is a show about the American government that ran um, quite a few seasons. 
I think it ran six or eight seasons. I think it, it was on till 2006, so it's not on anymore. And you just, it ran um, from 1999 to 2006, and it ran for, let's see, uh, seven seasons. And this show is absolutely amazing. It's completely nerdy. It's all about the American government and the West Wing of the White House. And it follows their day-to-day -day life and um, everything that goes on in the White House. And basically, you have to be really nerdy to love it because it's not on air anymore. And it only comes on at 7 and 8 in the morning on this TV channel here called Bravo. And you have to be very dedicated to watch this show, especially for an 18 year old who definitely didn't know anything about government while it was on air. Um, my other favorite show is Lost, which I'm currently almost done with season two. I started at the very beginning and it just makes me nerd out. It, I love analyzing things. I love literature and um, which brings me, I love Charles Dickens too. And um, the show just makes me happy because I'm able to analyze it and I'm able to figure out everything that's going on or at least try to. It makes me think. Um, like, just, it's like loving Inception, some, like in that sort of nerdy way. Um, I'm very introverted. I don't like talking to people really. Um, I will avoid talking to people at all costs. I would rather stay in my room and read. And there's really, I don't see anything wrong with that. Um, I, unless I'm able to talk to people about Harry Potter, that's how I make all my friends, really. Um, let's see, I've been in advanced placement classes, or like smart people classes my whole life. Um, I came into college with 17 credit hours, and I'm in the honors program, which, um, that's pretty nerdy, because we, we're reading a lot of Greek literature right now. Um, we read the Iliad, which was fun, and, um... My final nerdy thing is that I'm doing NaNoWriMo this year, which is National Novel Writing Month. I'm writing a 50,000 word novel in 30 days. And um, you have to be pretty nerdy to want to do that because it's basically a month of isolation. And that's why I think I'm nerdier than you. Love you. Bye.